All right, shalom on, brothers. All right, before I get started with this lesson, I want to say, Call Halayim, La, Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Makakodash. Double honors unto the apostles and the elders at Great Millstone who rule well and push out this word at a high frequency. Peace and safety to the elect members laboring around the four corners of the earth, giving all diligence to make the calling of election sure. All right, what I have here on the screen is uh, a plant that's native to. Uh, the Southeast Asia in the Asiatic area, uh, which goes by the name of Go To Cola, G O T U K O L A. And uh, this particular plant here is a uh, it's an aquatic plant. All right, it grows in in a wet area native to the wetlands, um, so it holds a lot of uh, nutrients. The water uh, uh, keeps a lot of the nutrients uh, stored into the plant. Um, now this plant. Is, is good for a number of reasons, which I have a list of reasons, but primarily for memory loss. Um, and this is for brothers, you know, within Great Millstone who may have suffered from uh, or suffer from memory loss. You, you feel like you have a bad memory. You can't remember scriptures. You can't remember what you study. Um, you can't remember certain words in Hebrew or things of that nature. Well, you can incorporate go to cola, which you can purchase online. Just type it in and they have a list of websites where you can purchase this actual plant and it will uh, uh, help promote a, a, a healthy memory, uh, which is always a, a good um, use or a good function to have in this truth of ours, to, to have a good memory. Because, with, with you know, this truth holds a lot of knowledge and with not a lot, a lot of knowledge, you have to have room in your brain to store that, um, that, that memory of that knowledge. So, you you know, in, in our brains are, are packed uh, with metals from the, the air that we breathe, the water that we drink, and the food that we eat from the so-called white man. So this plant is a good way to counteract all the toxic, uh, um, you know, plants and, and animals and, and, and things that we may eat or digest that deposits uh, toxins into our bloodstream that flows to our brain and our heart and things of that nature. So I'm going to start out with this scripture here. This is um, Sirach, the book of Sirach, uh, chapter 38, verse 4. It says, The Lord hath created medicines out of the earth, and he that is wise will not abhor them. So here is, 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 is one of many medicines that Yahweh Bashim Shai created um, for the human body to help promote a, a, a healthier and a better um, body. Because our spirits are basically... Uh, uh, encapsulated in this flesh. So this is like our, our vehicle, so to speak. Uh, the body is our vehicle. So, you know, while we're in the flesh, we have to, you know, do the best that we can in this captivity to um, to make sure that it's functioning prop properly to, to help, you know, uh, further your spirit. All right? Because believe it or not, man, that, you know, if the healthier your body is, uh, your, your spirit works better, you know? Your brain flows better. Your, your thoughts is clicking. Your mood is better. Um, everything about you is enhanced. You're still in the flesh, and, and you know you're not. It's not going to get you out of captivity, all right. But it can promote uh, a, a good functions for you to have in the truth, man. And this is a good plant uh, here to take for brothers that may suffer from memory loss. Now I got a, a list here, and I'm not. I'm gonna go through it real quick. Not you know not, nothing fast, but. Uh, it's from everydayhealth.com, and it's entitled Five Surprising Causes of Memory Loss. Now, some of us brothers, you know, being, you know, back in the world, so to speak, um, having, you know, done worldly things, whether it was uh, taking medication like pain pills or, or uh, you know, certain, uh, you know, medicines that, uh, these, that deposit toxins in your brain could be a reason why we suffer from... Uh, from memory loss right here see this is um the study uh five surprising causes of memory loss and uh one is sleep apnea so lack of sleep uh can affect your memory throughout the night if you um you know wake up in the middle of the night a lot you don't you you know you don't properly rest all right that can affect your memory all right that's why it's good to drink certain uh, uh teas like you could drink a peppermint tea or a um you know a, a tea that, that's soothing and promotes uh, good sleep, all right, to help, you know, when you go to bed, you know, you sleep a little better, which you ain't, we ain't gonna sleep, get, get, uh, Edomite type of sleep here in America, 
you know, we in captivity, so we got a lot, a lot on our brain, a lot on our spirit, so, you know, we got to just try to do the best we can with this thing, man, all right, another one, it says silent stroke, I'm going to read a little bit of it, it says, obvious changes in the ability to think or move normally can come from strokes that block major brain blood vessels, um, mild memory problems can also develop gradually after silent strokes that affect smaller blood vessels. So them silent strokes, you know, we may, may have strokes and don't even realize we having a stroke, man. All right. Because it's not a, a major stroke. It's a silent stroke. All right. So number three, it says medications. All right. So if you ever took sleeping pills in the world, antihistamines, anti-anxiety uh, medicines, antidepressants, painkillers, diabetes medic medications. Okay. Those medicines affect your memory. All right. Your cognitive skills. All right. Your ability to think and, and, and process information properly through your brain. These these things affect that. So you can counteract it with the go-to cola. All right. Another one, nutritional deficiency. Our diet, what we eat. All right. Like I was saying, a lot of our foods are packed with uh with uh harmful metals and toxins and parasites that um that affect the way our body functions. All right. It literally, it, it, it literally uh, makes the spirit and the flesh go against each other because the flesh is worn down, it's beat up. It don't have the proper vitamins and minerals to, to, uh, to push through. But the spirit is like, I got I to gotta make it happen, you know? So this is, um, you know, like I said, something good to counteract these effects. And also stress, anxiety, and depression can cause memory loss. All right, so I'm going to read... <clears throat> A couple of um, this is an article from organicfacts.net. Uh, Eleven interesting go-to cola benefits. All right. Now I'm not like you brothers can go in and, 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 and you know do your research on it. I just want to skim through it, get some of the, some of the good benefits of it because uh, this could be very useful to 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 you brothers in whichever camp you may be uh, involved with, man. All right. This is um all right. So one of it says speeds wound healing. So not only do these this plant promote um you know uh, a healthy memory, it promotes a, a healing. It's a it's a healing property within this plant that helps to uh, heal wounds, whether it's cuts, gashes, uh, scratches, scrapes. All right, whatever you know, whatever it may be, it can speed it can speed it up, man. All right, skin care for brothers that may have certain skin skin issues, whether it's uh you break out in hives, eczema, uh, acne you know, spots, whatever the case may be, pimples, blackheads, hey, you could put this on your skin, it can help you out. Uh, boost boost cognition, which is your, uh, the ability to, to remember, all right, protects gastrointestinal system, so it helps promote a healthier tract uh, in your, uh, your intestines, all right, you, you know, anti-inflammatory uh, and antioxidant properties come come with this thing too. All right, boost circulation. Hey, it boosts your blood circulation. So when you boost your blood circulation, all right, your body is more alive, is more lively. Your brain is functioning properly. You got blood flowing uh, 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 to, through every part of your brain, through your heart. All right, speed up your heart rate, all right, which is healthy. And it also um, helps your, uh, your rod, man. Good blood circulation helps your rod work properly too, man. All right, relieves anxiety. Detoxifies the body, regulates blood pressure, prevents nervous disorders, enhances sex drive. So, hey, man, it even help you out in the bedroom, man. So, you, hey, you, you can't go wrong with this, man. All right, this is a good, a good thing that Yahweh Bashima was shy, you know, got set up for us, man. So, you know, we can utilize these things as, as much as possible in this captivity. You know, like I said, it's not gonna get us get you on a chariot, or it's not gonna make, you know, make make you get out of captivity or the, you know things of that nature but it will help you know to 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 push you and, and, and uh have you more motivated to uh to work and get better in this truth all right so i'm gonna close it out with this last scripture in the apocrypha this is uh the book of Sir, uh, sirach chapter 30 and i'm gonna start at verse let me see start at verse 14 it says better is the poor being sound and strong of constitution than a rich man that is afflicted in his body, all right? 
So it, it's better be to be uh, poor and, and, and sound and strong in constitution than a man that's rich, got a whole hell of a lot of money, and his body ain't worth shit. Like uh, who was this this uh this elite that died recently? I think it was um David Rockefeller with all them transplants. And he you know he had all he got all the money in the world. I bet his life was miserable, man, because the shell that his spirit was encapsulated in could no longer do what what his spirit wanted it to do. All right. So if you take if we take care of this, cause hey man, this this flesh is corruptible, and Esau is is, is putting things in the air and in the food and in the water and in the uh in the airwaves, the frequencies, he's putting things out there to, to, uh, to shorten the span that these bodies were created to, uh, to last. So we can counteract that, um, that aggressive, um, shot from Esau. All right. Verse 15, health and good estate of body are above all gold and a strong body above infinite wealth. So, hey, you can strengthen your body. But, you know, the scriptures tell you, and uh, I think that's in the book of James, um, it says uh, bodily exercise profiteth little, but it does profit. All right. The reason why it profiteth little is because it's not going to get you on no chariot, man. You know, it's not going to, it's got, it's not going to, you know, save you from the time of Jacob's trouble. All right. It's not going to protect you from, uh, um, you know, from death. You know, only Yahweh by Shema was shy can. All right. So if you if you do incorporate bodily uh, uh, or promote or push uh, bodily uh, health and strength, there's nothing wrong with that. If you in the spirit of Yahweh by Shema was shy, you could exercise, you could take the herbs, work out, uh, uh, you know, and things of that nature to make. Of course, you can make your body uh, uh, feel, you know, better, man. That, it ain't nothing wrong with that. You know. It's just, you know, we haven't grown up in a society that, that it was pushed on us, man. We got, you know, Pop-Tarts and, and noodles and, and, and hot dogs and hamburgers and, you know, the whole American uh, diet was pushed on, on us, brothers, coming into this world, man. So we have to try to counteract that as we continue to further in this truth. And, you know, take certain things like brothers in the group text here in, in Atlanta was going into the colloidal silver. You know, and the different benefits behind the silver. How, you know, it, it cures you, it detoxifies you, uh, your body, you know, gets rid of metals and things like that as well. It cures uh, certain diseases. All right. So these things are actually healthy for us, man. I'm going to finish with the last verse. Verse 16. It says, well, I go to, I read 17 too. It says, there is no riches above a sound body and no joy above the joy of the heart. So, hey, man, there's nothing out here comparable to a sound body, man. And the word sound means whole or healthy, all right? When you look up the word sound, it means whole or healthy, man, all right? So there's no riches above a whole, a wholesome body, man, a body that's, you know, got, you know, good blood flow. Your, bland, your brain is clicking properly. You got good vitamins and minerals in your bloodstream. You're drinking a, a good amount of, you know, your body is alkaline based where no germs can really live in your body. All right. You're getting rid of parasites. All right. Tape worms and, 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 and candida and different uh, diseases that you may be dealing with. All right. There's nothing wrong with attacking those, man. Getting rid of them. All right. And making your body feel better, man. Where you can just wake up and you don't feel tired. You're in a better mood. You got, you know, your personality is growing in the truth. You know, you remember, you remember, your memory is, is, is uh, good, your, t your time management, your focus, everything is just clicking better and properly, man. All right, that's a good thing. Verse 17, it says, death is bitter than, is better than a bitter life or continual sickness. So you don't, hey man, you don't want to, you know, be just sick every damn day, man, especially if you can, uh, if you can handle it. All right, so brothers, I hope this was useful. Like I said, it's called Go To Cola, and you can purchase it online. You can look it up, do more research on it. You know, and uh, you know, if, if the spirit moves you, man, be my guest, man, get you some. So with that, say all praises, glory, and honor to Yahweh by Shema Shai. Double honors once again to the apostles and the elders at Great Millstone up in New York City. Peace and safety to the elect, men, women, and children. Shalom.